Hi guys and welcome back to God's Virtual School. Yep, yep. Welcome back to God's Virtual School where we just love, love, love teaching about Jesus and God and the Holy Spirit and just so many wonderful things that God has created. And you know who's the finest of his creation? We are. Boys and girls, God created us in his image and likeness and we are going to learn more about that. But we are going to take time and we're going to acknowledge some of the people that we know just from all around the world. But before we do that, let's open up with a word of prayer. Father God, thank you so very much for this awesome opportunity to make videos and to be able to share them around the world so that boys and girls and their families can be strengthened for you because we know that the Bible is the most important book in the world. May we spend a lot of time learning, sharing, and teaching, and living, and praying, and giving like you want us to do. That's what Jesus did. It's in his name that we pray. Amen. Amen. Jesus did all of that, and he wants us to be his hands, his feet, and his mouth to be able to share around the world wherever you guys are at. And we want to say thank you to some very special people that we know. And we're going to say some of the names, not all of the names, and some of the places where they are from. This is so exciting. And if you'd like to send us an email at God's Virtual School to let us know that you're watching these videos and that you're being blessed and that you're blessing other people and that your family is being blessed, please let us know. We would love to hear from you. And it's God's Virtual School at gmail.com. God's Virtual School at gmail.com. So we'd like to take time to thank some people from around the world. Let's go to Buenos Aires, Argentina. Okay, we're going to say hello all the way to Argentina. We're going to say hi to who are our friends over there, Joe? We have pretty here. I go to the list, okay? We have Brittany, Maho, and Benjamin. They are in Buenos Aires, Argentina. And we have friends like in China, we have friends like in the Philippines. Hi Ariana, she's all the way in the Philippines. And then we have here um, in, in, in this state, uh, Tennessee, we have Sayla and her uh, sister Isla. Say hi to them. And we have um, in India, we have Gloria and we have Sunny. And then we have Willow, Avonlea, and Scarlett, and they're in Tennessee, and we have Faith, and we have Johnny. Okay, and then we have in Germany, we have David, D-A-V-I-D, -D, and Ivan, and they are brothers all the way in Germany. And Ivan is I-V-A-N, and then we have all the way in Russia, we have Alex Trey. Isn't that what you call him, Brother Harry? Yep. Hi, Alex. A-L-E-X. Yay! That is correct, Joe. And we want to say hi to all of those people because we get an opportunity to travel the world and there's some people we haven't seen yet and we're planning on seeing, but we get little gifts like this little koala here. I remember him, Brother Harry. I remember him. Yes, that came from Argentina. Yep, that came from Argentina. Maho gave this to me when she was a little girl, and we did a video of her um, back. But now she's um, a teenager, and she's tall, and she plays she plays basketball, and she got baptized last year. So that is just really beautiful. Now these little beads, I was at a New Year's um, party. Ooh, but here these, here these are nice beads. Okay, Joe. They came from two special girls. Yes, one's name is Rory and the other person's name is Raylynn. 
and she was just so small. She was like in elementary school. Now they are in high school, high school. And we just love teaching kids about Jesus when they were really, really small. And now they are doing well. We also have another special girl. Let me see if I can find That is one. This is the other one. Okay, and that was Mackenzie, Mackenzie, Mackenzie. Her name is Mackenzie, and she lives all the way in California. And we are really good friends. I met her when she was about three or four years old. So I went, went to her pre-K graduation, then her kindergarten graduation, and in 2022, went to her high school graduation and she is doing really well. As a matter of fact, I received a card. She was visiting in Reno. She was visiting in Reno, and she went to a church there, and there were people that um, I knew from there, and she got a chance to talk to some of the people and told them that we had a really good relationship. But then I received a card. Ah, and it was really, really nice, and so, it's just beautiful just to be able to live for God. And also, this came from Argentina too. This uh, little book right here. It's in Espanol. Brother Harry, can you read Espanol? No, I cannot. I can, Brother Harry. Oh yeah, look at there. Look what's in here, Brother Harry. There's a picture of Brittany. I don't know what she looks like now. Well, you don't know what she looks like now. Yes, Joe, so they just gave me nice little gifts and it's just really neat to be able to share God's love just around the world. Oh, Joe, I almost forgot. This right here, this nice seashell. You see that? Don't Brother Harry, that's nice. It sits over there, yes. It's nice, it's nice and shiny, Brother Harry. It is. And where did that come from? Oh, I remember New Zealand. New Zealand, huh, Brother Harry? Yep, from New Zealand. All right, and then, uh, what's the next one, Brother Harry? What is that, Brother Harry? This is a boomerang, and this is a souvenir we picked up in Australia. Australia. Well, Brother Harry, that's one of those um, 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 boomerangs that you throw, and then you throw it, Brother Harry, and it's supposed to come back. Can I try it, Brother Harry? No, Joe, no, 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 we have to be outside. Oh, okay, 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 Brother Harry, we have to be outside, okay. All right, anything else, Brother Harry? Oh, yes, there are so many things, but we'll save that for another video. Brother Harry, you got to show one more, the one from China, the one, the big one sitting over, over there. Okay, Joe, I'll go get that one. All right, I'm gonna need two hands, Joe. I'm gonna need two hands. You have two hands, Brother Harry. I mean, I'm gonna need your two hands to help me with it. Okay, Brother Harry, two and two is four. Say it after me, Brother Harry. Two plus two equals four. Joe, I know two plus two. No, Brother Harry, you have to say it. Teach the boys and girls. Okay, boys and girls, two plus two equals four. Is that better, Joe? Yay! Give Brother Harry a round of, of, a round of, round of applause. He is just so smart, boys. <laughs> he is just so smart, boys and girls. Okay, Brother Harry, let's go get the souvenir from China. Boys and girls, you see that? Okay, I can lift it up. This is heavy, Brother Harry. This is really heavy. Hey, Kim, keep lifting. Brother Harry, you said you're gonna help too. Okay, I'm sorry, Joe. Pretty heavy thing, heavy. Pretty heavy, it's heavy. All right, all right, let's go sit back down. Okay, all the way. But here, that's all the way from China. This is big, buddy, Harry. This is so big. Okay, let's open it up, Joe. You pull it that way and I'll pull it this way. Okay, three, two, one. Come on, Joe, pull. Joe, Brother Harry, 
This is his one last time he when the last time he had this open, but Harry. Well, it's been a while. It's been sitting over there in the corner. Okay, but here yeah, I think we might have to switch um, uh, switch um, um, um signs, okay? And what you I think it might be the same. Oh, really heavy. Okay, we need to work out more. Boys and girls, do you guys work out and do uh, push-ups and sit-ups and things at home? Yes. All right, we do push-ups and sit-ups. But here we should do a video. We should do a video of our work, uh, our, our workouts. Joe, I think that might be a great idea to be able to do that for the boys and girls because God wants us to keep our bodies healthy. That's right, buddy Harry. You remember that one time we were talking about um, our bodies as a temple um, um, of God and that we should take care of our bodies? Yeah, Joe, that's really good. We can talk about that too. But right now, you need to use your body to help me pull this sword out since you were the one that had the genius idea. Let's get the body, let's get the sword the one from China. Can you hear me? That's not me. You let the fun of me. Oh, okay, Joe. I'm sorry. All right, you ready, Joe? We have to do it because time is ticking away. One and two. Okay, but I got a good thing. Okay, don't say three yet. You can rip my arm. Okay, I'm going to count with the hair. One. Two. Two and a quarter. Come on, Joe. Don't rush me, Brother Harry. Don't rush me. I'm trying to get a good grip. Okay. Two and a quarter. Two and, um, what's that for a quarter, Brother Harry? A half. Two and a half. Um, three. Um, two and three quarters. Okay. No, two and three quarters. Harry, you messed me up, Brother Harry. I'm getting nervous. We gotta be able to do it. Three. <laughs> What happened, Joe? <laughs> Joe, you alright? Joe! <laughs> Joe! <laughs> Joe! You okay? Joe! Do <laughs> Joe, okay. Alright, alright, Joe. We're gonna have to do we're gonna have to do CPR. <laughs> Don't you put your lips on me, brother here. We not doing CPR. <laughs> I remember that one winter when we were outside and it was cold and I fell down. He was like, you do some CPR. I'm like, no way, I'm fine, brother here. I'm fine, I'm fine, fine. All right, Joe, what happened then? Brother here, this is, um, I think he's kind of too hard. We might have to wait and do a, a, another one. Joe, are you giving up? Brother here, you put it like that. We should, we shouldn't give. We shouldn't give up. We should try our hardest. And I think, Brother Harry, that I was trying my hardest. Okay, well, Joe, if you feel that you were trying your hardest, and that's all God expects that uh, for us just to try hard and to do our best, that's what God expects from us. And so if you felt that you were um, doing your best, that's it. Okay, we'll just move forward. Okay, Brother Harry. No, I'm not going to go down like this. We're going to try one more time because I think I have a few more ounces in there, Brother Harry. Few more ounces. Okay, because I eat some spinach today. Um, no, that wasn't spinach. What was that? Um, collard greens. I ate some collard greens. They were so good, boys and girls. Do you eat your, your vegetables? Because it's really, really good to eat your vegetables. Okay, Joe. If you feel that you could do it, you have a few more ounces. Yes. Okay. Well. But here I need to do a few more. Uh, I need to do some push-ups first. Though. Joe, you. But here I said I need to do some push-ups. Okay. All right, Joe. I'm going to let you do some push-ups. Team. Good job, Joe.
dun, 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 dun. Joe was shooting a video. All right, I'm just getting pumped up, Brother Harry. Let's try it again. You sure, Joe? Okay. Please, I didn't go to all this not to try it again, Brother Harry. All right. Give it to me, Brother Harry. Give it to me. Keep Brother Harry. Let's do it. One, two, three. It's coming, Brother Harry. It's coming. Okay, be careful, Joe. Don't touch it. I'm not gonna cut this. I got this. I got this. Okay, I got you, Joe. All right. All right, Joe. Use your other hand, Brother Harry. All right, Joe. I'm going to use my other hand. All right, let's put it back in. Woo! Okay, I got it, Joe. Oh, Brother Harry. I did it, Brother Harry. I did it, Brother Harry. See, boys and girls, you always try hard. And if there's a few more ounces in there, try again. And always remember to work out, do exercises around your house. There's so many things that you can do. All right, we're going to get to the lesson, but there's some other things I'd like to show you first. All right, Joe, this is what we have. Now, these three things remain. Faith, hope, and the greatest of these is love. 1 Corinthians 13 and verse number 13. Now, here, do you recognize that? This is the Leaning Tower of Pisa. The Leaning Tower of Pisa. And this is so beautiful. All right, and my adorable wife, Audrey and I, we were blessed to go there. So boys and girls, we just want to encourage you to live for God. Now you never know where God is going to lead you, where God is going to allow you to go and meet different people all around the world. And one of the things that we like to do is that we like to surround ourselves with like just positive, um, just positive things uh, around us. Get ready here, can we please show them the room that we shoot the videos in? We've, we've never done that before, Brother Harry. Okay, Joe, I think that we can do that. All right, Joe made a special request, and so we're going to do that. But remember, faith, hope, and love, the greatest is love, found in First Corinthians. 1 Corinthians, um, the 13th chapter and 13th verse. God wants us to love. And we love all those people that we mentioned. And there's so many more that we don't get to see and talk to. But we would love to receive emails um, um, from you to hear. Remember, it's God's virtual school at gmail.com. Everybody here, let's show them um, this room here. This, this room here. Okay, we have pictures of family. We also have a map of the United States. See that? Because good Lord's willing, we are going to travel, continue to travel the world. We're not going to let COVID stop us. Yeah, and then we have a map of the world. But here, can you point out some of those places that you've been to? Yes, Joe, we can do that. Let's see what we have here. Let's see if I can get up close. All right. Because guys, you see, God blessed us with this beautiful world. And I believe that God wants us to see his wonderful creation. So here in the world, we have, this is Africa, right here, all right? And this is South America, 
And right down here is Buenos Aires, Argentina. That's where some of our friends are. And then we have Peru. We have friends in Peru. Hi, Luciana. All right, then we have Mexico, United States. We are right here. Okay, then we have North America. We have Alaska. Oh, Brittany Harry, show them that picture from Alaska. Joe, we have to get moving on this video. Oh, please, Brittany Harry, please. Okay, Alaska, and then we already said Africa. This right here is Europe, and we have Germany. Okay, we have France. Oh, and um, we have, let me see, England been there, we have friends over there, and then we have Russia, let's see, Australia, and over here, this little, little bitty one right here, that is New Zealand, yes, New Zealand. So, God has blessed us, blessed us, and we want to continue to travel, and we want to continue to hear wherever you are at, wherever you are at, north, east, south, or west. Send us an email. We would love to hear from you. Oh, and we also saw the Eiffel Tower. God bless us to see the Eiffel Tower too. It's just really neat. But I want to show you this after I go get what Joe wants me to get. This right here, don't know if you can see this. This right here, God bless me to serve 20 years in the United States Air Force with my beautiful wife coming along. And this is, I call her the bestest. And it says, to the bestest wife in the world. Because boys and girls, you wanna pray for a beautiful Christian wife or a beautiful Christian husband. So very important because God wants you to be happy, but you have to live for him. Don't do the negative things that the world tries to get you to uh, do. When I say the world, I'm not talking about the world. I'm talking about Satan and the things of his dominion, the things that he tries to get people trapped into. Yes, this is when we got married. They said this is like the picture of beauty and the beast. Oh, Blair Harry, are you the beast? No, Joe, I'm not the beast. Well, if she's the beauty, you have to be the beast. <laughs> and so, we were able to go when we got to Alaska. We were able to get on a helicopter and go up into the glaciers. And then when we got up there, we got up there, we saw a bunch of dogs. And then we got to go on a sleigh ride. The dogs were able to pull the sled through the snow and they were so excited when they saw us coming. Now this is what you want us to see. It is so very big. Okay, look at that. That's a halibut. And adorable Audrey, she caught that one right before we got ready to leave. Wow. All right. Okay. But I have to say this. I have to, have to say this. Okay. Now, this is what's really important. See up there? See what that says? Always stay humble and kind. And you see that there is an image of Jesus. That's not how he really looks. But still, you want to keep a mindset of who, 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 who your blessings come from. All right, let's get back over here. Pretty here, what's that B S S? Yeah, we gotta get back and we gotta get to we gotta get to the Bible. Huh? Yep, we're gonna get to the Bible with the hearing. But you tell me what BFF means. Well we're kinda BFFs. Okay? Is that like beef, brother Harry? <laughs> no. It's not like beef, brother Harry. What is BFF? Okay, let me get this set back up. Okay. Alright. Joe is talking about this card over here. And this card says BFF, best friends forever. 
That's right, Brother Harry. We're best friends. Where'd you get that card from? Yes, who? That is. Oh, I gave this to adorable Audrey because she's my best friend and the Lord wants us to have. Okay, Brother Huey, let's do it. Let's do a song. Let's take a break and do a song. Okay, let's do. Jen, 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 I say, sex, 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 sex. Okay, Joe, I think that will be good. Okay, now listen to the words. Listen to the words of this song. All right, because what you're gonna say, and there's hand motions too. And so, if you want to learn the song, and you want to send us videos, you want to send us videos of you guys doing a song, we will put that, Lord's willing, on this channel so you can see yourself. All right, we hope that you will do that. Okay, well, let's just play the song and then we'll talk about it. All right. Okay, guys, have fun. Exodus, well, they, but God, he parted the Red Sea for Moses, and they were leaving. They were making an exodus. That's what that means. They were taking off, and we'll talk more about that. Genesis, Exodus, and then Leviticus, Leviticus, Brother Henry, Leviticus. That's where all the laws were, the laws, and, 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 and they had to follow those, those laws. And, and, and God was leading the people. He was leading the people day and night. That's right. What's the next one? Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus. Ooh, numbers. Yes. And you know, God had their numbers. He wanted a roll call. And we'll talk more about that as well. And then Deuteronomy, Deuteronomy means repeating. Deuteronomy means repeating. Now what that means is that God gave the law a second time. And he wanted to remind the people of their responsibilities. So he gave them the law one more time. All right. Okay. So hope you guys enjoyed that song. And let's do some more. Mm, let's see. What are we going to do now? But I already know. I know what we should do. Let's um, talk about the different books of the Bible and some of them. Okay, Joe. That sounds good. All right, you guys have your Bibles? Go to the table of content. Brother Harry, I think we should let him know that how many books are in the whole Bible? Do you guys know how many books are in the whole, whole Bible? 66 books. 66 books. 39 minus 1 equals no, excuse me, 40 minus 39, no. How do we do it, Brother Harry? Joe, it's 40 minus one. Yeah, Brother Harry, that means 39. 
39 in the Old Testament and 27 in the New Testament. Yay! A total of 66 books. Yay! That's correct, Joe. All right. If you don't have your Bible handy, we want you to have your Bible handy. But for those who may not be able to, we're going to put all the books up there. All the books, the 39 books. We're going to put the 39 books up there on the Old Testament. And so let's look at those books. There's 39 of them. You got Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Joshua, Judges, Ruth, 1st and 2nd Samuel, 1st and 2nd Kings, 1st and 2nd Chronicles, Ezra, Nehemiah, Esther, Job, Psalms, Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, Song of Solomon, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Ezekiel, Daniel, Hosea, Joel, Amos, Obadiah, Jonah, Micah, Nahum, Habakkuk, Zephaniah, Haggai, Zechariah, and Malachi. Well, Brother Harry, that's the 39 books. But Brother Harry, I think we should help the boys and girls out by spelling them. Okay, Joe, I think that is a great idea. I think that is just a wonderful idea, okay? And so we're going to spell them out for the boys and girls, all right? Okay, Joe, you start off with the first one. I knew that one, Brother Harry. That's Genesis, and that's J-E-N-E-S-I-S. Joe, 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 Joe. No, no, no. What did you say the first letter was? Um, G. No. <laughs> it was J, Joe. It was J. Play here. Rewind the tape. Rewind the tape. We want to do a replay. Joe, I wouldn't I wouldn't mess with you like that. Play here. Okay. Are you telling the truth? Of course I'm telling the truth. I live for God. That's right, we do live for God. God wants us to tell the truth, Brother Harry. So, can I try again, Brother Harry? Of course, Joe. Okay. Genesis. J. Oh, I fooled you, Brother Harry. It's G. <laughs> oh, yes, Joe. You did fool me. G E N E S I S. G E N E S I S. Genesis. All right, Joe, I'll do the next one. Exodus means they're leaving. E X O D U S. Okay, so you have Exodus. All right, let's say them together. Say those two. We're not going to put them up yet. So say Genesis, Exodus. One, two, three. All right, good. Now put them up. Genesis, Exodus. Now the next one is Leviticus. L E. The Brother Harry's my turn, my turn, Brother Harry. Wait a minute, Brother Harry, my turn. Yes, you're right, Joe. Okay. L-E-V-I-T-I-C-U-S. The Bidicus. Great job, Joe. Praise God, Brother Harry. All right, the next one is numbers. N-U-M-B-E-R. S. And the next one, Deuteronomy, D E U T E R O N O M Y. Deuteronomy. All right, let's say these together, guys. One, two, three. Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, and Deuteronomy. All right, you guys say it. Yay! Yeah, boys and girls, good job. Okay, Joe, I'm gonna do a few and then I'm gonna have you do a few. All right, let's do this. Next we have Joshua, J-O-S-H-U-A. Next one, Judges, J-U-D-G-E-S, Judges. Ruth, R-U-T-H, 
R-U-T-H. Then we have 1st and 2nd Samuel, S-A-M-U-E-L. S-A-M-U-E-L. Samuel. 1st and 2nd Kings, Brother Harry. 1st and 2nd Kings, K-I-N-G-S. Kings. Pray, Brother Harry, put them together. Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Joshua, Judges, Ruth, 1st and 2nd Samuel, 1st and 2nd Kings, and then after that, 1st and 2nd Chronicles. Boys and girls, Joe and I cannot wait to tell you something about each book. Wow, so amazing. But we want to learn the books first, okay? So 1st and 2nd Chronicles. All right, after that is Ezra. But here, but here, you forgot the spell Chronicles. Oh, Joe, thank you so very much. Chronicles, C-H-R-O-N-I-C-L-E-S. C-H-R-O-N-I-C-L-E-S. Chronicles. Now we have first and second Chronicles, and after that comes Ezra, E-Z-R-A, E-Z-R-A. And after that, we have Nehemiah. Nehemiah. He's the one that filled the room, Brother Henry. We're going to do a nice video on that because that's what lads the leaders. That's right, Joe. We have a lot of work to get done. And so we want to be praying and get to work and not waste time. Nehemiah. N-E-H-E-M-I-A-H. A little bit slower, Joe. N-E-H-E-M-I-A-H. A H Nehemiah. Then we have Esther. Esther was so beautiful. She was the king. That's so beautiful. I can't wait till we get to Esther and talk about Esther. E S T H E R. E S T H E R. And then we have Job. No, Joe. Remember, we don't say it like that. Well, that's right. Job. Job. Oh, wow, well, brother hearing. We get so many exciting stories and they're bubbling over that we can share with the boys and girls. J-O-B is pronounced Job. Did I get it right? Yes, Job and not Job. Okay, then we have Psalms. P-S-A-L-M-S. P-S-A-L-M-S. And after Psalms, we have Proverbs. P-R-O-V-E-R-B-S. We have Proverbs. All right. Okay, let's go over to the other side. But Harry, we forgot something very, very important. What is that, Joey? He forgot to tell them the breakdown, the combination, remember? Oh, but Harry, I can't believe we forgot that. Oh, but Harry, we got to tell you guys, boys and girls, we got to tell you about the combination. Okay, the combination is 5, 12, 5, 5, 12. 5, 12, 5, 5, 12. Okay, Joe, tell them what that means. Okay, so the first five books are known as the books of Moses. Some people say the books of law. And so the first five books are broken down into the books of law. Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, and Deuteronomy, like in that song. And then, after that, the next number we had was 12. Remember, if you said 12, that is correct. And the next 12 books, so if we count the next 12 books, You'll get Joshua, Judges, Ruth, 1st and 2nd Samuel, 1st and 2nd Kings, 1st and 2nd Chronicles, Ezra, Nehemiah, Esther. Right? Those are the next 12. Brother Harry, count them to make sure. Okay, I will. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So that's from Joshua to Esther. But you hear it, but you didn't tell them what that was about. Oh yes, Joe, you tell them. Well, boys and girls, and family, 
because a lot of adults need this too. Right, Brittany Harry? Isn't that what you say in the other videos? That's correct. This is a wonderful opportunity for parents who may who grew up and they may not grew up going to church. You can learn about these books. And so this is from these books are called History, History, H-I-S-T-O-R-Y, History of Israel, the Israelites, the Jews, the Hebrews, they are all the same. So anytime, boys and girls, you hear the Israelites or the Jewish people or the Hebrews, Hebrews? Is that how you say it? Yes, so Hebrew. Okay, those are all the same people, God's chosen people at this point in time. And when you get down further, we're going to learn how the people who were not Jews, how they became believers. Yay! All right, that is correct. These are called the history books. And we can find about God's history. Really, if you look at the word history, let's do it like this. Capital H, I, S, okay, his, K, and put a dash, and then you put story, S-T-O-R-Y, S-T-O-R-Y. And so when you have history, it's like his story. God's story. Did you guys get that? Now it's not spelled the same, but when you hear um, the history of Israel, it's like God's history for us. His story. His story. H-I-S-T-O-R-Y. His story. We're learning about God's story. That is amazing, Joe. All right, thanks for remembering that, Joe. You're pretty smart. Praise God. I praise God for everything. God is so good, boys and girls. You want to praise Him every day. Thank Him for your family. Thank you for food, uh, clothes, and cars, all the, a house, all those things. You can say, thank you, Lord. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, Joe, let's continue. And that is right. We want to keep on thanking God for everything. But hey, we didn't show them that side of the wall. Oh, we didn't. Joe, do we have to? Well, Brother Harry, you, at least you can read it. Okay, I will do that. Maybe I'll, oh, I know what I'll do. I'll read it and then we'll take pictures and we'll send them. You are so smart. Praise God. I thank God for my noggin. Brother Harry, a noggin? What's a noggin? Oh, this right, this right here. Oh, you mean your dome? No, <laughs> Joe. Oh, gee, I'm just having fun. Okay, go ahead and read it. Okay, this one reads over here. All right, so this one says, my prayer to God, Lord, I lift up every one of my relationships to you and ask you to bless them. That's why you pray for other people too, Brother Harry, yeah? I pray that each one would be glorifying to you. Help me to choose my friends wisely so I won't be led astray. Give me discernment and strength to separate myself from anyone who is not a good influence. I release all my relationships to you and pray that your will be done in each of them. In Jesus' name, amen. And so boys and girls, you keep in mind that if boys and girls are being bad at your school, you stay away because there will be a negative influence. And so you stay away. You stay away from negative things that are online too. So uh, negative things that are online. And the other one is dream as you will live forever. Live as if you'll die today. And what that means is that just have fun. Just have fun. Because one day, God is going to take us home. He's going to take us home. And so we want to do that. 
really you're gonna tell about the Easter Bunny? Oh man, that's one of my favorite pictures. I was walking in one of my favorite stores, Walmart, and the Easter Bunny was there. And so I wanted to go and sit next to the Easter Bunny. And they took a picture of me and I, you know, I knew they were taking pictures. But then I came in the store again and they just loved the picture and they wanted me to have one. And so I took that picture and it's been a favorite picture of mine because just you gotta have fun. You have, you have, you just have to have fun. You know, I don't want to grow up and be a stuffy adult. I want to have fun. That's why we make these videos. That's right, because we have fun. Living for Jesus is the best fun you could ever have in the world. That's why my shirt says, I love Jesus. I love Jesus and Jesus loves you guys. And so have fun. Live like you're going to live forever. And just because one day we're going to live forever. That's why we live for God. All right, Joe, we have some books to get through. All right, let's do this. people that God used. Adam was the first man, Seth was Adam's son, Noah built the ark, Shem was son of Noah, God gave Abraham the promise that all families on earth will be blessed. Through him he'd be the father of all the nations. Isaac, son of Abraham, Jacob, son of Isaac, Jacob. Wait a minute. Yeah, wait a minute. One, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, son. 12, son, through the eight. One of those sons of Judah, through him, King, King, David. That was King David, who fought Goliath, taken into captivity for 70 years. God, people that missed it, taken into captivity. Jesus, the Lord's Messiah, 14 generations. After captivity came the present storm. Excellent, guys. Let's go back to the top to see how many generations were between these men that God used. Ten generations between Adam and Noah. Ten generations between Noah and Abraham. Fourteen generations between Abraham and David. Fourteen generations between David and captivity. Fourteen generations after being released from captivity came Jesus. Many generations from Jesus to you. Can we do that again? Sure. It's a beautiful song. All right, sing along. Adam was the first man. Seth was Adam's son. Noah built the ark. Shem was son of Noah. God gave Abraham the promise that all families on earth would be blessed. Through him he'd be the father of oh, all the nations. Isaac, son of Abraham. Jacob, son of Isaac. Jacob, wait a, wait a minute. minute. Yeah, I remember he had 12 sons for the Harry. 12, that's right. Okay. One of those sons with Judah through him, King King David. That was King David who fought Goliath, taken into captivity for 70 years. God, people didn't miss it, taken into captivity. Jesus, the promised Messiah. Fourteen generations after the captivity came the promised Messiah. Excellent, guys. Let's go back to the top to see how many generations were between these men that God Ready, go. used. Ten generations between Adam and Noah. Ten generations between Noah and Abraham. Fourteen generations between Abraham and David. Fourteen generations between David and captivity. Fourteen generations after being released from captivity came Jesus. Many generations from Jesus to you. That's so beautiful. God bless you all. All right, buddy here. Get back to reading. The next five books are Job, Psalms. 
Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, and the Song of Solomon. All right, you got that? Job, Psalms, I think we spelled Proverbs, did we, Joe? Yep, Larry, we did, we spelled Proverbs. But this Ecclesiastic, Ecclesiastic, Ecclesiastes, Joe. Thank you, Ecclesiastes. How did I say it, Brother Gary? Did I say it like you? Ecclesiastes. No, I didn't say it like that. Ecclesiastes. Ecclesiastes. <laughs> okay, Joe. Smell it. E C C I E S I A S T E S. Great job, Joe, but a little bit slower for the boys and girls. E C C L E S I A S. T E S Ecclesiastes. Then the next one is the Song of Solomon. S O N G O F S O L O M O N. All right, it's three words. What's the first word? Song. S O N G. Second word. Uh. O V. Last word. Solomon, S-O-L-O-M-O-N. But Harry, you didn't tell him what this five stood for. You are correct, Joe. I know you're gonna praise God, we always praise God, but you're so smart, Joe. Praise God, but Harry. I knew you would say that. But Harry, I knew you would say it too. Cause that's what we do. We give praise and glory to God. We should do a song, but Harry. Joe, you wanna do a song? Oh, Joe, I don't, I, I don't, I don't know a song. Brother Harry, we can make a song, okay? We can make up a song. Yeah, we can make up a song, pretty good. The pray God. Okay, you ready, Brother Harry? Uh, yes, Joe. Do you, I, this was, this was your idea, Joe. So I'm gonna let you, I'm gonna let you run with it. Nobody said we're not gonna run anywhere. We still got to shoot a video. We can't go running now. We we'll work out later. Oh, that's right, Joe. We're not gonna run now, Joe. Okay, we're just uh, well, I just let you do the song. What the song? What was the song about? See, Joe, that's what happens. Your mind just moves so fast. You just move fast too, brother Harry. <laughs> Okay, Brother Harry, time is ticking. Time is ticking. Okay, Joe. Okay, Brother Harry. All right. So, okay, Joe, you said you wanted to uh, make up a song. Um, and you were talking, the song was about, you know, praise, because uh, I had said something and you said, praise God. That's what it was. Praise God. I said, some years so smart. And you said, praise God. I know what I see, Brother Harry. I love saying that every day. I'm, 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 I praise God, I thank you. So let's do a song. We just make it up. Ready for the hear? Okay. A one and two and three. Praise, praise the God of heaven. Praise, 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 praise his name. Praise, praise, praise God heaven. Praise, praise, praise his holy name. Your name is holy. Name is mighty. Name. Wonderful, he is the counselor. Praise the Lord, God. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord in heaven above because he, he is so. Awesome. Good job, Joe. You're just so awesome. So you better hit praise God. Can I give you a hug, Joe? Praise God, Joe. You're the best too. Alright, love you. Big, don't kiss me on my ear. <laughs> I'm just showing you some love, Joe. Okay. You want me to kiss your hair? No, that's okay, Joe. Alright, let's go. We gotta get in. Joe, we gotta get back to the Bible. Okay, that's right. It's getting late. Alright, let's go. These are the books. Poetry and Wisdom. Remember, 5, 12, History of Israel. Poetry and Wisdom are the first 
um, five, the five, Job, Psalms, Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, and Song of Solomon. Then the next five are Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Ezekiel. Jer Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Ezekiel. Did you hear me? Daniel. Okay, is Daniel the fifth one? Let me count. Yes, Billy Harry, please count. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, that is correct. Yes, Billy Harry, that is correct. The next five are known as poetry. No, 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 poetry and wisdom. Um, um, um. Come on, Joe, you, you have this. We did, I think we did two videos of this, Joe. That's right. That's why we did two videos. Major profits. Major profits, Brother Harry. Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentation, Ezekiel, Daniel are the major prophets. But we have to spell them for the boys and girls, Brother Harry. We have to spell them for the boys and girls. Okay, Joe. Let's do it. Isaiah. I-S-A-I-A-H. Little slow, Brother Harry. I-S-A-I-A-H. A H Isaiah. The next one, Jeremiah. J E R E M I A H. Jeremiah. Lamentation. L A M E N T A T I O N S. Lamentations. Ezekiel. E Z E K I E L. Ezekiel. E Z E K I E L. Okay. So let's do those. Bitty Harry. Bitty Harry. Yes, Joe. One, two, three, four. What comes after four? Um, five, Joe. Okay, remember, we said five, twelve, five, five. Right, do you remember that, Brother Harry? Yes. Okay. Then why are you doing five, twelve, five, four? That's not the right combination, Brother Harry. It's supposed to be five major prophets. And you say it, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Ezekiel, where's Mr. Daniel? Oh, Joe, 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 you are right. I'm sorry, Mr. Daniel. You are a major prophet too. And I do not want to mess up the combination. No, no, no. It will not work because this is the word of God. So, Daniel is a major prophet. So. D A N I E L D A N I E L Daniel. So these are the five major prophets Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Ezekiel, and Daniel. This break, Billy Harry, and the next ones, they're not the major prophets. But they are the minor prophets. They are the minor prophets, Brother Harry. The minor prophets. Now, Brother Harry, do you know the difference between a major prophet, the major prophets, the four major prophets that you want to teach us? No, <laughs> Joe, I apologize. I put Daniel in there. Yes, you did, Brother Harry. The five major prophets. And then the next Number, boys and girls, do you remember? Five, twelve, five, five. Almost said it. Do you remember? Oh, I'm busting. Twelve. The minor prophets, twelve. We're going to go through there, and then we're going to wrap up this video. I'm so excited, boys and girls. Aren't you excited, Brother Eric? Yes, Joe, I am really, really, really excited. Okay, now, there's major prophets and there's minor prophets. Now, the question that Joe was talking about, what, who are 
Are the major profits more important than the major profits? The minor profits, excuse me. Are the major profits more important than the minor profits? Reason why they're called the major and minor profits is because the major profits, they wrote just a little bit more in their books than the minor profits, okay? But they're equally important. Okay, let's go through the minor profits. All right, let's go and it starts with Hosea. Hosea, oh, let's go through all of them first. We have to keep doing a refresher. Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, what's next? Deuteronomy, good. Joshua, Judges, who does Judges, who Judges, who does the Judges judge? Ruth. If you said Ruth, you are correct. And then there's three first and second. First and second Samuel, first and second Kings, first and second Chronicles. Let's do that again. All the way there. Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Joshua, Judges, Ruth, first and second Samuel, first and second Kings, first and second Chronicles. Then we have Ezra, Nehemiah, Esther, Job, Psalms, Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, Song of Solomon, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Ezekiel, Daniel, Hosea, S, no, I'm sorry, H-O-S-E-A, H-O-S-E-A, Hosea, Joel, J-O-E-L, J-O-E-L, Joel, Amos, A-M-O-S, a-M-O-S, Amos, Obadiah, 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 sorry, Obadiah, no, Joe, Obadiah, okay, hear me, Obadiah, okay, put it together, Obadiah, okay, very good, Joe, O B A D I A H. O-B-A-D-I-A-H, Obadiah, J-O-N-A-H, Jonah. Nahum, N-A-H-U-M, Habakkuk, but anyway, that has three K's in it, H-A-B-A-K-K-U-K, Habakkuk. Zephaniah, Z-E-P-H-A-N-I-A-I-A-A-H. That's funny. Z-A-P-H-A-N-I-A-H. Zephaniah, Haggai, H-A-G-G-I-A. Zachariah. But are you read a video on Zachariah? Okay, Malachi, the last book in the Bible. M-A-L-A-C. C H I M A L A C H I Malachi. All right, we love you, boys and girls. Let's pray. Father God, be with everybody. May they learn your word and teach your word and share their word. It's so beautiful. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Love you guys. Step back by. Don't forget to email us, God Virtual School at Gmail. Hey guys, let's sing this song about the New Testament books. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, Acts and the letters to the Romans, 1st and 2nd Corinthians, Galatians and Ephesians, Philippians, Colossians, 1st and 2nd Thessalonians, 1st and 2nd Timothy, Titus and Philemon, Hebrews, James, 1st and 2nd Peter, 1st, 2nd and 3rd John, Jude and Revelations. Let's do it again, guys. Okay, let's do it. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, Acts and the letter to the Romans, 1st and 2nd Corinthians, Galatians and Ephesians, Philippians, Colossians, 1st and 2nd Thessalonians, 1st and 2nd Timothy, Titus and Philemon, Hebrews, James, 1st and 2nd Peter, 1st, 2nd and 3rd John, Jude and Revelation. Yay! We did it, brother.
good in here? We sure did. Praise God.